gain on the play. It'll be second down. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. Oh, not sure he saw the linebacker there as that's batted down and incomplete. The chance of wasting this great starting field position, a real threat. This is third and law. Oh, into a sea of defenders and intercepted. Deion Sanders, the former Falcon with it. And the Patriots are going to take over at their own 13-yard line. The Pats at the line ready to go. And they've got less than 30 seconds to go here, so not a lot of time to work with. And that is taken in by Njoku. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. But normally you see three tight ends in a formation. You have to think to yourself, this has got to be a run. And I know as a safety, when I saw that, I took an extra step or two towards the line of scrimmage. Instead, they threw the ball, and he found one of those tight ends for a very nice pickup. And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. Now the Patriots going to use one of their timeouts as it will come with 15 seconds to play in the first half. And it is caught. It's Calvin Johnson. And they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. I think this defense was still trying to recover from that last play, so you wonder if they were ready for this one. You have to imagine their defensive coaches are yelling at them to get focused, because if they don't, more plays like that will result in giving up points. And we're going to get a timeout with two seconds remaining in the second quarter. A bit of a surprise. They're going for it with two ticks remaining. No side of the field goal unit. Oh, they go with a tight end carry. And he is in. Touchdown, New England. Pat Fryermuth in the final seconds of the first half. And the Patriots have a chance to tie the game here in the final seconds of the half. Extra point by Blankenship is up and good. And we are tied here in the second quarter. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. On the return comes Drake. So we've hit intermission. It's halftime. This is the NFL, and it's a presentation of EA Sports. Okay, Coach, yeah, adjustments likely going to play a big role in this third quarter in what's been a tight contest so far. And ready to get the party started for the second half. It was an even first half, all tied on the scoreboard. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. The Pats at the line, ready to go. It's a tie football game here. What do you think, Charles, the message was at halftime? Well, I think that they probably just looked at things and said, we're fortunate that this is a tie game. No need to panic, no need to change a whole lot. We didn't play anything close to our best in the first half, so we don't have to go out and win one for the Gipper. Let's just go out and play our best football and win one for us. And he gets this up across the 35 before he's out of bounds. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Out of the gun, it's Tomlinson. And he'll maneuver his way forward for about four, second and six. From the 40 now on second down, Manning. And he checks this one down to LT out of the backfield. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. Caught that look from you there, partner. I think we're on the same page on that one. Just his first catch. I think we both thought he'd be a little more active in the passing game. Let's see if that's the start of them trying to get the ball to him a little bit more here in the second half. And he's got this down a yard or two shy of the 40 before he's out of bounds. Nice work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. From the gun, they give to Tomlinson. And they'll be inside the 35 now at the 34-yard line. On first down, Manning flush to his right. And he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Derek Wolf popping in for the sack. And that time, finally, a measure of revenge as they get him down behind the line. It almost felt like relief, didn't it? Because with the success he's had throughout this game, 
You'd almost expect him to get free and pick up 10 to 15 every time he takes off. Not in that case. That has to feel good for the defense. So it's third and six, and this will be the eighth play of the drive. Manning going to throw. Eluding the pressure right. Man open, it's Moss complete. And he will have a Patriots first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Here's a first and 10 at the 14-yard line. On the handoff, Tomlinson. And he'll get about three just outside the 10, stopped at the 11. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Throwing his Manning. Sliding out of the pocket. And down inside the 10 here before he's out of bounds right around the 7. One quarter remains here on a Sunday night. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. This a big play for both sides. What will we see here? Third and four. And he will have the first down before he's brought down at the three. I tell you, they didn't give it to him much through the first three quarters, but when they have, he's been efficient. Maybe they ride him more here down the stretch. Yeah, not sure it was actually in the game plan for him to have as few carries as he has. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Patriot touchdown. LaDainian Tomlinson, a three-yard touchdown run. And the Patriots have moved out in front. Extra point by Blankenship is up and good. And the lead is now 21-14. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. On the return comes Drake. And he will make it to the 20-yard line and no further. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And now they'll look to answer working from behind. And remember, this offense has sputtered yet to score here in the second half. They'll need to change that here. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and ten. Out of the gun, it's Taylor. Flushed out right. And his throw's going to be incomplete. So many times we talk about coverage, we're just talking about a defender running with a receiver, but a big part of it is understanding where the football is, finding it. In this case, when it arrived, it wasn't a surprise, and he was able to bat it away. And for a third time tonight, he's intercepted. Picked off by the Pro Bowl safety cam chancellor. And he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Patriot defense has a touchdown. Blankenship out for the point after. He's got it as they double up the lead. This one's now 28-14. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. On the return comes Drake. And he'll get it up just past the 20 as these guys will go to work at the 21-yard line. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. We'll see if they can band back together after the pick six. It hurt badly, but still within striking distance. A two-score game with a good chunk of time on the clock. Taylor's throw taken in here by Jackson. And up to the 35 before they're able to knock him down. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. From the shotgun, it's Taylor. Escaping the pressure right. Now he's going to throw deep right side. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. They've been trying and trying, but they haven't sacked him yet. He's been able to get away and make plays. Tried to make another one downfield right there, but to no avail. They'll have to keep up the pursuit, though, and not let him get hot. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. Again, it's Taylor. He's going to look deep down the field. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Deion Sanders, the former Falcon, with it. 
And the Pats are going to have it here as they'll start at their own 24-yard line. Well, obviously, Charles, this stage of the game, down two scores, they had to put the football in the air. Unfortunately, it gets picked off. And the criticism comes easily in situations like this, but you just laid it out. Look where they are on the scoreboard. Look at where the clock is in the game. He has to take a chance here and try and get the ball downfield to his receivers. Unfortunately, it was picked off. Manning going to throw here. He'll buy some time right. Moss going to have a first down and more. And he's going to get this to the 40-yard line. We talk about mobility on quarterbacks all the time. Here's where it really pays off. Able to move, evade, and is accurate throwing on the run and picking up a first down. Looking for more there on first down, but this throw downfield incomplete. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. On the handoff, here's Tomlinson. Some nifty running, but it only gets him to the 45. Four yards the gain, and it'll bring up a third down. Now the Falcons going to use one of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 34 seconds to go in the game. Throwing is Manning on third down. Rolling to his right. And it's going to be incomplete. He was able to catch it there on the right sideline, but out of bounds, says the line judge. And it's going to bring up fourth down. On fourth down, the punt team is on as this is sent away. They'll get nine yards on the return there following a punt of 42. And control of the football, switching hands here with very little time remaining in this contest. About set to begin their next drive, the Falcons offense at the line. They can't do much at this point, partner. This one is going to go down in the loss column. You don't make up for what has happened during the game in this sequence here. Maybe you hand it off, let someone run the ball if you, if you so choose. But otherwise, just kneel down, call it a day, and try and prepare going forward. Now Taylor. And Gordon's got it. And they're able to work this to the 25 before it's all said and done. And now here comes their final timeout as they take it with eight ticks remaining. Taylor. This is cut. And he is into the end zone for the touchdown. So they still need a miracle with a clock where it's at, but they get one piece to the puzzle done. Still have hope. Extra point by Anderson, up and good. And now things get a bit more interesting here in this fourth quarter. Following the touchdown, here's Anderson to kick it away. And here comes a return from a few steps into the end zone. And he's going to go out of bounds on the return. He won't even get this thing back to the 10-yard line. Manning will take a knee, and that should be the final act in this one. So this will wind up a victory for the New England Patriots. And we talk so much about the turnover battle determining who wins and who loses. This game, no exception. They didn't turn the ball over at all, and they go on to victory. They look like a smooth operation in this one, didn't they? Because you look at every facet of the game, they handled their business. Offense took care of the football, converted it into points. Defense took the ball away, gave it back to the offense. Special teams right there with them. That's the type of game a coach is going to really love and value. And when they show the film, they have to be careful not to give out too many kudos and kill their motivation going forward.